Grammy Award winners, the Chainsmokers. Hello. Hey, man, this is awesome. You know, you're back to Arizona. Arizona loves the Chainsmokers. Cool. Do you guys love Arizona? We have a good time here, for sure. We've been to Phoenix a bunch this year. We just did the, the big uh, Final Four party. Yeah. That was sick. Um, like spent a lot of time partying in, in Phoenix. Right, right. Yeah. Is there a particular place that you like to party when you're here? Oh, we just go to Scottsdale and like, you know, there's a bunch of bars there and stuff. Yeah, Old Town. Yeah. Yeah, it always There's nothing, no, there's nothing old about it. Yeah. It's like all new clubs. <laughs> now, with the grind that you're doing right now, right? You're yeah. on tour, it's nonstop. Mm-hmm. When do you get to bed? Whenever we can. Not much? <clears throat> yeah, I mean like, like on this tour, it's not bad because we like, we're on a bus tour, so you can consolidate your travel time with your sleep time. So actually, we've been sleeping a lot more. I don't know if we've been functioning better. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I feel a little bit better, but... Uh, yeah. We're like, I function better off no sleep. <clears throat> uh, do you get recognized all the time now? Because your fame has just blown up. Um, not, not the crazy. I mean, we live in like LA and up from New York, and I feel like those places are very like respectful of people not to say that anyone even recognizes me and they're being respect- respectful maybe they don't even know mm-hmm. but it's like one of those places where like everyone's cool the only time like if we fly into a city like i don't know we have a big show in chicago and you people kind of expect us in that like area you know like there's a festival going on and our hotel is like a mile away that's like people will be like oh what's up what's up but everyone's right. really cool we always we have the nicest fans and everyone's like really cool no one's like come into the middle of like our dinner and like interrupted anything or well with your fame you're probably meeting a lot of famous people have you freaked out about meeting somebody famous pretty much anyone famous i'd get yeah. excited about sure yeah anyone name it i cool. mean literally who has been like the biggest celebrity that you've met that kind of made you feel a little starstruck drake was a massively starstruck moment meeting drake? him, and he was so cool and nice and it was like cool calm down man he's like chill you know what i mean like That's he's just so- a nice you know nice guy and was really you know, I thought I was going to be like a huge imposition for us to say hi to him and be like, dude, I just want to like say hi, but be, be out of your hair. And not, you know, and he right. was like, no, what's up, guys? Like, I'm a huge fan. Like, That's awesome. and you're just like, wow, that, that was sick. Well, you guys yeah. have worked with crazy artists. I mean, like the biggest. So who was the most surprising to work with, like the best work ethic or just really kind and sweet? Who would? Uh, we love think? the uh, Florida Georgia Line guys. Oh, my yeah, God. Yeah, they're just so that. they're like a lot like us, you know, and they just like like to have a good time and. They enjoy themselves and, you know, they've like really, what I admire about them is like they go to a city and they like do what they want. Like they both like bring cars with them and like go and explore the city. Um, BK like loves like getting like collectibles and stuff from every place. And it's just cool to like, they're just like, they're all about the culture, you know, love to hang out with them. Your fans have become rabid fans. You feel that, right? And you feed off of that when you're we on stage. We were just saying our fans need to become meaner. Not to us, <laughs> but to like other people. Because like other fan nation armies are so aggressive uh, and like protect their artists like at all costs. Yeah. And our fans are like mellow, a little more chill. They're That's like, cool. Like if we're getting like... Hey, we have to respect how they are, you know? No, I mean? they must get angry. <laughs> they must become, <laughs> have they, must, they done anything crazy? No, they're really chill and nice. I mean, I, they're polite fan. We have a very really polite, polite fan, fan, base. fan base. Do they have a name? Kind of like Beyonce has the Beehive. Yeah, the pack. The pack? Yeah. I like it. Yeah, it's cool, right? Can I be part of the pack? It's done. It's, yeah. It just happened. Yeah, I love it. It just That's happened. That's great. <laughs> You're really nice too. You'd fit right in with everyone. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. <laughs>